Welcome back to Sunrise Daily. Well, uh, we're focusing on the fight against corruption. Of course, uh, so much going on uh, these days, but uh, the most recent one concerning the former First Lady and the EFCC. Uh, that report will come up in a minute, but uh, let's flip over to uh, where our first guest is. Mark has got that. Mark Ware. Well, thank you, Chamberlain. I have with me in the studio Mr. Charles Ogbuli, who is a human rights uh, watch and anti-corruption activist. You're welcome to Sunrise Daily, sir. Welcome, madam. So what can you tell us about this matter? We did initially hear that the EFCC had, um, had accused four companies and the First Lady's uh, former aides of, you know, some amounts of money, or accused them of some amounts of money found in their accounts. And uh, the First Lady had gone to claim... Uh, you know, she, she said, yeah, she said that those monies were actually hers and that uh, she was able to get them back, you know, through some process. Can you exactly tell us what is yeah. going on? Really? Yeah, what is going on is a worrisome in the sense that uh, the stories uh, in pages of newspapers are not true reflection of the story. There is no personal knowledge of facts. Mm. Uh, the information uh, EFCC is circulating is not the true pictures of what really happened. And being an anti-corruption activist, I'm against anything that has to do with corruption. Mm -hmm. And I believe that it is my duty to fight against an innocent person, either by intimidation, either by witch hunting. Fight against yes. or fight for an innocent for, person? Yes, yes, that those that are in corruption activities, I fight, again, I, I fight for it. Mm. Now, the, the story is all this. The first lady, uh, as far back as uh, sometime 2013, uh, she wants to travel out of the country for medical reasons, mm -hmm. uh, attention. He called on uh, the domestic uh, essay to the president, uh, Dr. Dudafa. And he came in, and he told Dudafa that he wants to travel for medical attention. And in turn, traveling with uh, physical cash, Dudafa now said he want to get clarification from EFCC, if it is possible to travel with cash. That was while she was still First Lady? Yes, yes, then. Then um, he contacted EFCC top officials. And they advise that you should open an account on which she asks the essay to the president, Dudafa, to contact a bank for which he can open an account. The essay now came in with uh, Sky Bank officials, two Sky Bank officials. And they brought a form. She filled the form with her personal data. There is no company involved. Mm -hmm. After filling the form and sign, they took the form away. And after some few days, they came back with cards. They didn't come back with any checkbook. They came back with cards. Now she started operating this account. What names were on the cards? Her personal name was on the cards, mm -hmm. the first card. The other two cards was the mother's name, uh, business name. The mother used two of the accounts for business. So they were registered in the name of companies? No, they were. The, 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 the fact is that the, 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 the name on the card is supposed to be the name of the mother herself. But unfortunately, when the, the ugly development started, when she noticed that the card he was having, three of the cards were in a company's name. Did, did you get it? Pluto and Steelgate and the Transoceans company. These are uh, the, the, the companies that ESC is alleging that he has a link with. So she did have those cards with her? She has the card, okay. but the card, what really happened? When she noticed the, uh, that the card was not bearing her name, mm -hmm. it's only one that bears her name. Mm -hmm. 
and she reported. He, he complained bitterly. They had to call the attention of the, the, the special advisor on domestic affairs, mm -hmm. uh, Dudafa, that what is all this nonsense? That I, I did not ask you to open an account with company. Who owns this company? Dudafa said, oh, it, it could be a mistake. He said, please, I want these names to be changed. Then Dudafa now went back to the, the, to the Sky Bank and came in again with two banks official. And when they came in... Mr. Abuli, uh, just a moment. Are you privy to this story? Where, where yes, you, I, am. Uh, I am. Because, I mean, this account you're given is not anywhere in any of the dailies. Did you, the account? Yes, I mean, did you speak directly with Dudafa or did you speak directly with the First Lady? Well, I speak with, directly with the First Lady. I have the details. What I'm telling you is a fact. Mm -hmm. It's not just a, spe a speculation. Yeah, it's, it's very important that our viewers understand where, you know, where... Yes, that, where, that, that is where what I'm, 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 try, I'm, I'm, I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. Because the issue on ground now, ESCC uh, made some revelations that 22 million, 15 million, 30 million, that is not a true story. Mm -hmm. And the issue is that it's money laundering. That is not the true story. The true story is that she opened a personal account. Mm -hmm. And the personal account, the bank... The Sky Bank made a mistake. I, I can't call it a mistake. It could be a deliberate act. There is, I mean, you, did, you, did you get it? You and I own bank accounts. Of course. I mean, there is no way that you will open a personal account and then you will have your personal account and then have four extra accounts opened for you in companies' no, 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 names. No, 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 no. Is that Listen, what you're saying? Happened? What I'm saying, the three account Bluto, Seagate, mm -hmm. Trans Oceans. She filled a form for personal account. Yes, which is one account. Yes. yes. Now, it has one account. Yes. The mother has two. So she also filled forms for her mother. Yes, she, yes, you can fill form for the mother because uh, the mother is, is not educated. What is names it? did she use for those? For, because you did confirm that the mother was using... He used the mother's name. Those accounts for business. That, that is what I'm telling you. He used the mother's name. On those cards. That was while her mother was still alive. Then when, when she was still alive. He used her mother's name. I used her name. And when they returned the card, she discovered that her name was found on only one. The mother's name did not reflect on the other account. Then she complained. Take this card You said back. her mother was using the, the companies. That she, no, no, no. no. That get, she get had right. companies that she was get, using it for business. No, 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 no. The mother is a petty business trader. Okay. You don't understand me. If they trade, they pay money into that account. That is what they do. It doesn't have business name. They were not dumb accounts, were they? They are dumb, domiciliary accounts. Did you understand me? With petty business? Uh, it, it is a, a, a dumb account. You can change uh, Naira and pay in dollar into the account. Did you understand what I mean? That is it. But what I'm saying, let, just get it straight. A form was brought after these mistakes for the first lady and for the Sky Bank to effect a change mm -hmm. based on the fact that the cards given to the first lady was bearing names of companies that is not known to her. Okay. So how, now, long, how long ago was let that? Me, let me, let me, let me. Can, let can me. you give us a time frame? Yeah, from 2013 and 2014. 2013. Yeah, because the account was not open uh, immediately. All the accounts was not open immediately. Okay. It was one. Then the mother wanted to open the open two. Then when they brought the cards, the, the, the first lady noticed that these cards were not bearing uh, the mother's name as it's supposed to be because the form she filled was on personal data. It was not on any company's name. The, 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 the bank said they are very sorry that they are coming back with a form to refill again. He said, what is the refilling? I filled the first form. They said, no, so to make it straight. He now they refilled another form. And they took it back. And he was complaining, where is the, the, the new card? Where is my checkbook? Checkbook was not given to her. They gave her only the card, the platinum visa card. That was from 2013, 2014. To 14. And now this card, he complained bitterly to the extent that it becomes a problem between them and the, the, the special advisor on domestic affairs, Dudafa. Now the, the bank officer said, Madam, we are going to change it and we, you can use the card. 
even though it bears the company name. He said, no. He said, you can still go on and use the card. We are bringing in the, 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 the changed name. As I'm speaking with you, they did not do that until when EFCC sealed up the account. She wanted to go uh, for a medical uh, trip. You could not withdraw any money. Then that is why you now call these people. You said you are going to change this name, and you have not even brought my checkbook. And the Sky Bank is saying that um, they are changing these names. The question is, if you operate a corporate account, we all know that before you open a corporate account, there are documents you are required to present. What are the documents? Certificate of incorporation. Article of Association and Memorandum, where the directors and the secretaries' names are shown there. And is it the duty? And before you open such account, there is what we call KYC, Know Your Customers, which you go to CAC to verify if these names tally with what you're having. And what the question is, if the, the, the EFCC are doing the due diligence, they should have gone to Skybank, find the detailed forms filled by the first lady, whether she's actually telling the truth. The form she filled was on a personal name. It was not on the company, any company's name. She doesn't have access to this company. You cannot be a signatory while you are not a director of a company. The board resolution is not there. So it's just mere wish hunting. I, I, I least expected this on her. Mm. You know, we're going to go to Lagos now and take a couple of questions from there.